what up and welcome to another episode of Crease T. Brand new episode. I got the brand new camera. We playing around. Seeing if this shit work. I don't even know. The shit is so fancy. I ain't up all the way to it yet. But we're going to do it anyway. Today we got an amazing review of a pair that... Look, we've done a pair similar. This is the other pair to the pack. There's probably a little bit more hype to this pair than there is the other pair. Let's just get straight into it. Alright, we have another unboxing modern day Nike SB box. I'm pretty sure I'll probably title this as to what it is, so you probably already know. So. Let's do it. Nothing real fancy with the box, but it is the Run The Jewels Nike SB Dunk Low Pro Quick Strike. For me, I've already mentioned when we did the high that I'm a big Run The Jewels fan and I probably prefer this than I do the high. Oh man, the leather tongue, I didn't even notice that. Suede on the inside. For me, I just feel like, again, it's the pink. I really, the quality of materials are insane. Like, you got suede, two different suedes, like a, maybe like a short haired suede there, then probably like a pig suede there. You got leather here. I don't know, it's probably, more like a tumbled suede. Your leather here. You look. Yeah. Gold hits. Yeah, it's not bad, man. Like it, it's. We got spare laces. We got. So three different blue laces. You get B-roll for all of this, but. Once again, they're not my shoes though. Um, I have not been lucky this year with raffles, but I also haven't really gone for everything. Um, for me, there just hasn't been... Just throw them around. For me, there just hasn't been anything that good coming out until like, I feel like maybe the UNC toes, I'll be after them for sure. But I wanted these, like regardless of the pink, I still would have wore these. I feel like if they had the Dubrays, they'd be that much better. The leather tongue is really nice. The suede on the inside, really nice. They do have the Run The Jewels logo on the inner sole. And then you've got Run The Jewels on the translucent sole. Man, these are... I mean, the high was growing on me. I had the opportunity to be able to get them for retail. I turned it down. They were Adam's pair. This pair is Adam's pair. He didn't hit on anything. He hasn't hit on anything since the Marina Blues, but he hit on these. So, I don't know what's going on. He's taking all my luck, maybe. Has he worn these? Got a weird mark in the back there. I ain't worn these, they've been in a box the whole time, so not sure what's going on there. But these are fire. These are from his personal collection. He let me review them so you guys get to see them in detail, in hand look. Not an on feet shot because they're not mine. Be pretty rude if I undies them on him, <laughs> but these are incredible, man. These are actually modeled on the third album, where the highs are modeled on the fourth album. For me, I feel like one and two probably have the best colorways to be able to model a shoe on, but you never know, we may get them. If these, well, they sold out everywhere, just like every SB done. Maybe we get the two and one. We'll see, see if the hype stays around. For me, I feel like they haven't released an album since 2020. I would have thought if they were going to do a shoe that would have had a new album and done that, but I'm not mad at it. I just noticed here you got 
the dark blue than the light blue. It's a weird paneling, but it just works. Might have to see if I can get Adam to do a trade on these, I don't know. Let's get some B-roll and wrap this up. I mess with this pair, man. It's much better than the high. I think it was just the hair on the high. If it didn't have the hair. But I've since found out that if you wear that away when you're skateboarding, there's like hidden imagery underneath it. I don't know if this one has a similar sort of thing. But Run The Jewels actually broke it down on a video on Nike SB YouTube channel. And it was dope to see. All the little questions that we may have had answered because yeah i feel like there's plenty of details but there could have been more for me i really wish this had the dubray but i really like these i feel like i'd wear them they're not mine shout outs to adam he keeps getting all the luck and he lets me review them for you so what do you guys think let me know in the comments let us know do you like the highs? Do you like the lows? I feel like last time some of the comments were like, I prefer the lows, but it is what it is. Different strokes for different folks. But this has been another episode of Crease Teep. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. We'll be back twice a week. Peace. Let's hope this has audio. There's a test run, I'm not sure what is going on. Brand new camera, we're hoping it's working. I feel like it might be, I don't know. I can't hear any, can't see any. What is going on? Let's just give it a run through and hope, hope for the best.